Hey guys, Shane here from Tripod Tech, and today we're going to take a look at the 512 gigabyte Vertex 4 solid state drive by OCZ Technologies. Taking a look at the outside of the packaging here, you can see that it offers a high performance design. It is running MLC flash memory. It includes a 3.5 SSD adapter for desktops. So you can fit this nicely into your desktop hard drive tray. It has SATA 3 6 gigabit per second capability. It offers trim support, which if you did not catch our last video, trim functions by actively deleting invalid data from the SSD's memory cells to ensure that write operations perform at full speed. And it's designed to maintain the performance of SSDs at an optimal level over the lifetime of the drive. And this SSD is running on an Indolinx Everest 2 controller. We'll go ahead and flip it over here and check out the back side. At the top here you'll see a little description of the SSD and the benefits that it offers as well as the fact that the OCZ Vertex 4 series SSDs are the more efficient and durable alternative to conventional hard disk drives mentioned in many different languages here. And in small print you'll see that to achieve maximum performance specifications, a native 6 gigabit per second controller is required, which is kind of a given. Let's go ahead and open up the drive. Pop open the lip on the top here. Grasp onto the inner packaging and pull it outward. It's in there pretty good. There we go. And right away here you'll see your 3.5 inch bracket. Flip it over and pop the flap open and you'll see a sticker that says my SSD is faster than your HDD. Which is again a given any SSD is going to be faster than a hard drive. You got your quick installation and warranty information followed by your drive in a nice little uh, anti-static package and the screws that you'll need to mount the SSD not only to the bracket but within your case if you do not have a tool list case We'll go ahead and take the SSD out of the anti-static packaging. Just lift up the sticker there. And it'll fall right out. It's a pretty sleek looking SSD. On the bottom side there's a nice brushed finish. And on the, the top there's a hard plastic and a, a sticker. So here we're going to show you how to go ahead and install this into the 3.5 inch adapter. In case you missed our Vertex 3 video, which showed you how to do that. And we'll go ahead and put a link to that in the description if you want to check that out. On the bottom of the SSD you'll see four holes. You're going to want to line up on the 3.5 inch bracket here. Just like so. And then we'll go ahead and start putting the screws in. And there you have it, the OCZ Vertex 4 installed into the 3.5 inch hard drive bay adapter.
Well, that is our overview and unboxing of the OCZ Vertex 4 512 gigabyte solid state drive. Thanks again for stopping by to check us out. And if you would please like, comment, and subscribe, it would really help us out a lot.